swapping, swapping, swapping. I don't. Sh I should tweet, but I don't know what to tweet. Maybe a picture of a. Hey. Chat. Hey, howdy, hi, hello, hello, hello. I have not tweeted for today, but I feel like. for twenty six months. Yo 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 yo. Thank you for the twenty six months. Um, tweet something cool. I don't have anything cool to tweet. Axial Mars donated five dollars exactly when you started stream. Doomies crashed, Sush. Great Who? job, Maya Stompy Weird. Who's that? What are you talking about? Tweet the foxes. I could just like tweet a picture of the foxes. I'm not catching y'all's drift. Uh, wow. Karen named 22 subbed for the first time. I need to find a picture of the foxes. Hold on. Thank you for the sub. Do you want to sit? We're going to be in here a minute. Um, I can't use the search function on Twitter. Wow. You know what's funny is, <laughs> thank you, um, I have to, dude, why is this text so big? Oh my god. Hold. When you search a picture on an iPhone, if you search Fox, it'll show me my pictures of Reed, but you have to search dog to get pictures of Finn. <laughs> All right, let's see. I want the picture of Finn where he looks really like, you know? Where is it? Where is it? Hello, Connor. Hey. So sorry. People talk, wow. Connor's chair has been for taken. Weirdo Shrub, thank you so much. Um, yeah, no kidding. Do you want my chair? Wow. No. Ray, my Raven resubbed for four months. Okay. Thank you for the four month, guys. Hold on, I'm I'm looking for a picture of Finn. Oh, it's pissing me off. I found it. Guys, you won't be disappointed that I waited this long to find it. Hold. Ah, oh, yes. The snow day that they deserve today. What? I need to buy 75 bags of ice live now. Snow. Tag people, Alvea Sanctuary. It's 103 degrees. Okay, I tweeted. Snow in Texas, yeah. Wait, 75 bags of ice? Connor is convinced that I need at least 50. And he was very, very confident about it. Yep, still am. Almost always right. 90% armor set closure. Mm-hmm. Oh god, we died. Oh. I tweeted it. Guys, look at that look at that picture of Finn. Isn't that a good picture of him? It's pretty good. He's looking right at me. <laughs> okay. So, where are you gonna get 75 bags of ice? We're, 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 we're working on it. You know, it's gonna take a little bit of time. We're going on a field trip. Let's start outside. Also, you guys stay with me. Today is gonna be turned into a YouTube video, so we're gonna have to record 
the way that we record the videos. If I forget something, let me know. So I'm sure I will. So we'll film an intro right now. Connor, here you go. Hey. Yay! Hmm? Thank God for nine months. I had a field trip. I'm hoping it didn't break in there. For them? For him. It, it looked fine to me. Space, is it broken? What? I don't know. Anything? The video's fine. Everything's fine. I can see. Nothing's good. broken. Just film an intro. All right, guys, don't mind this. Okay, we're just, we're just, we're just, uh, I need another phrase for two birds, you know? John Bennett is up for five months, field trip A. Are you speaking? We're rolling. Okay. <laughs> but you can't move very much because they can't see what I'm doing. Can they see? Why can't you see? Because it's in 4K and the monitor display doesn't work while we're outputting. Just go. Chat, does it look fine? Flip can't see it. My videographer doesn't know what we're <laughs> shooting. It's fine, I'm not worried about that at all. Yeah, okay, they said it looks fine. Okay, <clears throat> welcome to the intro of the YouTube video. Okay. <clears throat> YouTube, hello everybody. Welcome back to My House Fun For Once. Today, it's the same, it's a little different. I have an animal sanctuary, if you didn't know that. I founded it, I run it. It's called Alvea Sanctuary, check it out everywhere. Today, it's 103 freaking degrees in Texas and uh, the foxes, they're hot. And so I would like to give them a snow day, which means we have to make snow and get ice. Like and subscribe. All right, I one taked it. I one taked it so fast. Was that fine? Chat, how was that intro? What do you think? You know what? Hmm. Let me get my freaking no. Hmm. Never mind. Okay. Um, it was all right. Mid. The angle mid or was your too fast? Mid? You guys always think I'm talking too fast, okay? I'm not. I'm talking at a natural speed. That's what people like to listen to. Otherwise, they're gonna put it in two times speed. Angle was bad. Shut up. It, it, it was fine. You guys said it was fine. Now you're saying it's bad. It's fine. Don't look at the license plate. Um, we're gonna take Otis today because, okay, let's just. All right. Do you want to record again? Okay. <clears throat> Are you recording? Yep. Okay. <laughs> Here's the plan. So we have to go get a kiddie pool. We already know how to do. We've done it twice, right? We've done this. We've done the pool thing. We're pool experts. Easy. But then we need, Connor thinks we need at least 50 bags of ice. Connor works at Alveas. I, so I don't know where to get that. We might have to loot several gas stations. By, we're paying for it, okay? But we might have to go to several. Either because they don't have the inventory or because I'm embarrassed and I don't want to buy 70 bags from a single gas station. I feel like they'd get mad at me. So, I don't, we're gonna start with the pool. We're gonna put it in the in the cab, and then we're gonna go just start buying bags of ice until it feels like enough. I, th I think we just fill the kiddie pool and then do twice as much. Then we come back and then we shove it all in a snow cone maker. It's gonna be easy peasy. The foxes are gonna have a great time. It's gonna be perfect and great, and they're gonna love it. Happy snow day. All right, get in the truck. <laughs> Long time, Otis. You know it's been a long time because I can't see over the steering wheel. Don't mind this. This is what just what he sounds like. He's a 2006. driving out of the barn so we're not effing. A bit right. 
Good morning, Krusty Crew. Okay. How to waste energy make snow in Texas summer. How to waste energy type for a streamer that doesn't freaking care what you think. This is about the foxes, not you, chatter. Um, yeah, sorry. Are you recording? No, I am. Okay. Um, okay, so we're going to go... We're going to go to tractor supply. We're going to get a pool. And then we're going to find several gas stations nearby. And then we're going to start buying ice. That's the plan. Is that a good trip? Bed. Chatter, I'm putting it in the cab. So Okay. So oh. I think we're live again. Um, did I tell you about the comment section of that reel? You said it was controversial. It was so bad. Yeah. Sally emailed me and she was like, we're so sorry. Like, if, if there's anything you need to help respond to these people or if you want to do that. And I was like, Sally, I don't care. Sally's actually the best. We don't need to respond to them. <laughs> Go through and address all of their comments and questions and concerns. Chat, moral of the stories, I don't care about you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. I don't, I'll real. tell you when to put it up. We got a ways to go. What? I think the reel is better than the video. The reel is damn good. It's a good reel. Um, we have a... Uh, what are those? These are Adidas, you piece of shit. All right. Oh my, oh my <laughs> God. He's mad. Da -na -na. Guys, you want to hear Austin's best radio station? I'm going to show you. By Whole Foods Market. Ah! Oh, it's on commercial. I can't believe how many commercials I used to watch growing up when we actually watched TV. 
and it was just like a show and then like the same amount of time of commercials in between watching the show. So why are you watching? What do you want? Hello. I can't hear. Are we up? We're at 2K. We shouldn't be up. Hello. We're at 3K right now. Have we just been offline this whole time? Now we're at 5K. Okay. Connor's just calling because he's like, is it off of the ground? It is off the ground. What, were we, are you reading chat? Yeah. They're saying saved and we're back. Chat, how long have we been after? The whole time. It's pretty good. <laughs> I'm gonna have to retell what I everything I said. You're gonna have to listen to it twice. So why the Walking Dead? <laughs> did they hear about that? Oh, Chat. Did you hear about the Walking Dead? Did you hear about Netflix? Did you hear about my white noise? Nope. Didn't hear about any of it. What? None of it. All right. Let me know when I can point the camera back up. Oh, you can point it up now. Hey. Hey, were you gone this whole time? Are you for real? Are you back? You're gonna have to tell me via chat. They said yes, we were gone the whole time. We were gone the whole time? Oh my God. Last we heard, best radio station in Austin.
I've gotten so used to Binky Bonky speakers. This truck sounds like shit. How did I do this for so many years? It sounds so chat. Listen to this. Walks into the room. He watches every move. She oh my god, that's so tragic. It's okay, Otis. That's okay. Um, okay, so you didn't hear any of it. So what I was saying is Netflix is canceled because one, they're getting rid of their disc program, which is really messed up because my neighbor uses the disc program. And it's where you watch three movies at a time and then you put the disc in the mailbox and they bring you a new one, right? That's how he uses Netflix. He is unaware of Netflix as an app and having endless movies and TV shows at your fingertips, unaware. He's only ever used the disc program. But they're canceling it starting in September, which is really messed up of them, so that's number one. That also means that Space and I are getting my neighbor a hotspot and a smart TV and different Wi-Fi and frickin' a Netflix account, like a Netflix app, <laughs> okay? Um, so it's a whole thing, but he's, it's gonna change his life. But Netflix is also canceled because I turned my TV on the other day and they were like, this doesn't look like your household. Because it's my freaking dad's account. down for what reason? Are you not making enough money, Netflix? You don't want me to still use my dad's account? It's been fine for years. I don't know why it's a problem. So I'm pissed about that, number two. Flip is asking me why I watch The Walking Dead all of a sudden. And it's because it popped up in my binge-worthy TV recommendations. And now I'm almost done with season five because, and don't think that I'm just like sitting there watching it, okay? I have it on in my pocket while I'm doing things. And I said, I don't, honestly, I'm not even sure what the plot is currently with what I'm watching, but I've grown to like walker noises. And so they're kind of like white noise in my pocket because I'm gonna be honest, by the time you get to season five, all it is is walking a little bit on like a railroad or something, running into a bunch of walkers, killing them all, almost dying, and then walking again, or driving. Yeah. And then you run into more, and then you fight them again. You almost die, but you don't. It's very emotional. And then you go a little bit further, same, same, same thing. But if you like walker noises, it's like white noise, it's kind of nice. There's so much. So many better shows out there. You need to not watch one. Well, you just give up now. You know, you know what else I started watching? Hmm. Mer people. What is that? It's about professional mermaid industry. It's cutthroat, dude. Professional mermaid industry. Yeah. Like. Like professional mermaids, like ones that get hired for parties and shit. Like the thirteenth year. What? Never seen it. Mm -mm. Pretty good. Um, there's a big aquarium in Florida called Weeki Wachi that was like big for mermaids. I don't, you, you made that so dramatic. <laughs> Dude, you made that you so dramatic. Like I'm not, dri I'm like literally driving the speed limit. Story. I'm driving, that is because that's how the road is. You know that. You made that so <laughs> dramatic. I saw it in your I arms. That was ridiculous. Um, Weeki Wachi is like this big aquarium thing for professional mermaids. It got shut down by the state because mermaids had to go down a tube 16 feet and across 60 feet in an underwater tube with no air hose. Yeah, don't react. I was I was doing that so it could fucking Whoa, dissipate into the air. Crazy. Okay. <laughs> Whatever. Not this again. <laughs> I would rather hear you talk about the mermaids. Okay, um, so there are pods of them and it's super clicky. Like the pods of them are all, they're all friends and they all like compete and they're like elite mermaids um, and they're haters, like bottom line. They're just, they just seem to all be haters. Um, and then there are people that make mermaid tails. They're like three mermaid tail makers. One of them's the mer tailor. He has his own aquarium, but this this show it might save him might turn it around but i'm gonna be honest none of these people all these people are just broke broke i don't know how they get by and i don't know how you build an aquarium besides just so many business loans so many 
and I feel so bad for him. But maybe this Netflix show turns it around. Maybe it saved his life. That's pretty much all I got. Very interesting. I don't think I'm gonna watch now. No, you're not. You don't mean that. What are they saying? They're saying you're about to get a mermaid side job. I can't swim. You can't swim? That's false. <laughs> There's no way that's real. Yeah, I can swim. I can swim, but not well. I'm a very weak swimmer. It's one of my worst qualities. I found out it's been so long since I've swam that I'm a weak swimmer, too. Almost drowned in a lake the other day. You seem like a weak swimmer. I, I did <laughs> used to be. I used to be really good, but it's been years. I know. Long and for you to come home. Chat, what streamer do you think would be a good professional mermaid? I'll go first. Brit. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be so sick. They're all saying Zoil. Okay. Zoil can do it. He's got the hair. His hair would probably look really majestic in water. Zoil, Hassan, Austin. Austin just, would be good. They're just saying, saying people they want to see shirtless, that's all. Chat, between me and Flip, who do you think would be a better professional mermaid? I would be very majestic, just putting that out there. I don't think I would be. Everyone's saying me. It's not going to be competition. Um, chat, you're really getting the behind the scenes on me and Flip filming these YouTube videos. Except usually we talk way more shit. <laughs> if you, well, you really want to get the behind the scenes, let's talk about our problems. <laughs> I do. We do talk a lot of shit. <laughs> Not today, though. Today it's about mermaids and Netflix. <laughs> you know, the light stuff. Longing for you to come off. Let's see what's on the radio. You want to listen to the best CD? Ever created? This again? No! Chat, it's been a long time. I was hanging around town, spending my time out of a job, not her oh. dime. So sorry. A filter steps up and he said, I suppose. You're a brown fighter from the looks of your It is this again. You played this last time. Me right. You play this every time. This is the only CD you have. What? This is the only CD you have. Yeah. <laughs> also, it's like my prized possession. I'm so serious. And I can't get it out of this truck. Oh, no. It's part of why I put in, why I spent $3,000 on a brand new transmission for this truck. Because when this truck dies and I lose it, or it goes to a junkyard, I lose the CD. I don't know what to do about it. I need to put it on like a a, a jump drive. A thumb drive. A thumbstick. A thumb. <laughs> a jump stick. How old are you? A, a. What is it fucking called? A USB. A thumb drive. A thumb drive. <laughs> South Law Ken Buck. Um. All right, you want to film? And rolling. And we're rolling. Okay, we're going to Tractor Supply. I've done this before. Only problem is we're live streaming right now, so my cameraman has a backpack, which is way more embarrassing than just a single camera, I think. Um, so we're adding an extra layer of difficulty to me being in public and buying things while being filmed. But they know me at this store. They know I'm a big, famous YouTuber, so they're not going to care. How was it? You made me film for that. Yeah, and then we keep talking shit. And we go, bye, 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 bye. Admit, stuff like that is important for videos. Oh, of course. 
the this shit talking in between is important for the video too. I don't think this video is gonna be the same without shit talking in between. This is the first time I've made myself an iced coffee normally. Oh my God. Something terrible is happening to me. This has to go. This is the first time I made myself an iced coffee and I got this like concentrate cold brew <laughs> that you mix. And I think I put too much in there. Uh -oh. You sound like you put too much in there. What do you mean? You sound like you're about to start vibrating with energy. Like you're shaking. That's not staying. That's falling. <clears throat> Safety first. You look like a grandma with those on. He said that because that's what Connor said to him this morning when he walked in with the sunglasses. I'm pretty honest, I don't think you look like a grandma. I think you look like a bug. A bug? Yeah. Okay, that's Wolf's even more rain. Rain. What's the devil's You look like a bug. I know. All the time. These stick out. And it makes me look like a bug. Horse to ride and all of them are dead. Oh my god. I made a mistake. I told you you were shaking. Feels like there's a ball of electricity in my stomach right now. And right now, it could go either way. It could either be fun. It could either be fun or it could be it could give me a lot of anxiety. I feel like it could be fun. I can't play, you know what? I can play music actually off of my very cool Bluetooth device here. Um, this works sometimes, but you have to have an Altoid tin in here. Um, <laughs> because, because, you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, this may be some male bullshit because I dated a guy that was an engineer and he came to visit me in Texas and I was using this and I was driving this truck and I had a Altoid tin and every time it would go static he would put the Altoid tin in front of the radio and he said that it was I'm flip I know it sounds really stupid <laughs> and he said that it was helping because of the way that the, the antenna works and I was like, that's not true. But every time he did it, it was like, there's, I don't think it was a coincidence. Every time he put it there, it's, it's stopped going static. And it was like for a good stretch of road. He was like going like this and it would go in and out. But maybe he was just trying to impress me. Anyway, it didn't work. You I broke up with him. You believe in the power of rocks too, don't you? You are literally, Tamam is catching strays right now. <laughs> <laughs> Play around South America to the East Coast for candles and for jackets and for. This hats. is important information. And so here's her old song about Captain Dan. Oh shit! I need to send him a Father's Day card. Father's Day is Sunday, chat. This Sunday. Uh, the pepper tree. Chat, did you know that about me and Tamam? Me and Tamam got in an actual fight once over rocks. You didn't need to talk about it. It could have just been an inside joke. Can you not <laughs> reveal it to all of chat? Me and Tamam got in a fight over rocks one time. Um, he like, I don't even know. It was about like crystals or something. He was telling me that the, the he believed in them, and I was like, wrong. <laughs> um, and which is fine for us to think those things, but he was just being really pushy about it. And I was like, send me, send me a peer-reviewed academic journal about it. Send me one, um, and and I'll read it and I'll get back to you. And he sent it to me, and all it said was something about like metal being a conduit for electricity, and if that's possible, then like why can't crystals be a conduit for energy? Like, I, I don't really, I don't really know what to say to that. Besides, it's stupid. 
And then I told him to go get an aluminum can and put it on his desk, like a rusty one, because it'll conduct electricity, so maybe it'll conduct energy. And we got in like a fight. In fairness, I was kind of mean about it. So it was on me that we got in a fight, and I, I, uh, I do not retract what I think about it, but I do retract some of the things that I said. <laughs> I do apologize for those things. <laughs> got a little heated. <laughs> Flip! Uh, chat saw you grab it and they mentioned it and I was ah! like, very like into the rock story. I thought you wanted more. No, <laughs> I, I didn't more know, I didn't know. <laughs> Like it. I feel very restricted right now. I feel very restrained right now. So icky, I am still here. This guy's leaking. Should I tell him? It's probably as easy. Okay, I'm not gonna tell him. I hope it's just as AC, otherwise it's on you. Car guy. I mean, it just drips condensed air or water from the air. Okay. I already said the plan. I'm trying to figure out if there's a better one, and there's really not. I, I don't know. We can go here to get ice, in addition to gas, sta gas stations. But to go here, we'd have to go inside, put a bunch of ice in shopping carts, which is not that bad. Is that better or worse than going to a gas station? Which one's more embarrassing? I mean, no one's going to have just 70 bags of ice, unless you literally buy out the entire ice thing. Would they be mad at me if I did? No. Question mark, I don't know. <laughs> so you got the ice last, I know that. No, we're, yeah, we're going to get a pool right now. I'm gonna put the pool back here, like, flat, mm -hmm. and then put bags of ice in it. So if it leaks, it leaks into the pool. You know, the other thing is I have not tested the snow cone machine yet. Did you already buy it? Yes. Well, someone bought it off the wish list. So, but there's, I don't know if it works. I don't know how it works. It's probably gonna take forever. I feel like you're being really negative. Me? Yeah. You're just shit talking rocks. I love rocks. I also you're like rocks. Shit talking rocks. I like rocks too. I believe. No, you don't. Yeah, I believe in Santa Claus too. That one's fair. Chat. The Santa Claus is real. So is the Tooth Fairy. They're friends. Easter Bunny, though, is bullshit. The, the rabbits do not lay eggs. They're mammals. Duh. Please. We're breaking. We're breaking. Hey, I am not going to tell you this story. I'm going to tell you that story later. Yeah, no, go ahead. That's totally fine. I would have done the same thing right there. Car. I'm glad you're not huh? I'm glad you're not telling it. Didn't want to hear. Didn't ask. Okay, then I'm going to tell you. I got a rental car one time, <laughs> and I drove it to California to pick up the two foxes that were giving a snow day today. And you're not allowed to have pets in the rental car. And I drove foxes for three days from California to Texas in that rental car. And I brought it back, and they didn't say anything. They didn't know. I cleaned it very well before I returned it. And I had to air it out for like 24 hours. They probably thought you were rolling up in there. They literally, I'm sure, I actually <laughs> think that they did, but I didn't get charged for it. All right. Yeah, they're not pets. Do you want to say, we just arrived at the, we arrived at the thing of purple? Yeah, man, that's exactly what I wanted to say. I mean, I'm 
a great script right here. Go ahead, I'm ready. Right now? Yeah. Okay. And rolling. We're at Tractor Supply. We're gonna go to. We're gonna get a kiddie pool. I just drank a whole thing of coffee. I'm feeling a little crazy. I feel like I'm buzzing on the inside, which is really good for my anxiety and going in the store. But we're gonna get the smallest kiddie pool that they have because it's gonna take a lot of ice to fill it up already. We're gonna get a small one. We're gonna put it in the back of the truck. Then we're gonna go get ice. Here we go. That wasn't the script I wrote, but if you want to improvise, sure. Oh my god, can you just wait until the employee goes by, please? I'm gonna kill, I'm gonna kill, I'm gonna kill it today. I'm gonna do really good today. La 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 flip. <laughs> You look so much crazier with the backpack on. It looks so suspicious. It's cute. It's pink. I look good in it. Nobody's going to care. Chat, we've been in here before. We've been in here multiple times. Filming. Times. Okay? We're literally just getting a pool. Getting in, getting out. Oh, my God, dude. Okay, and we're rolling. Okay, let's go. <laughs> let's see, except last time we came in here... I was streaming, but I was filming it. Can you put the camera down when we walk in the store? So it doesn't look like a fucking documentary. Last time we came in here, I had a phone, so it was way less, like, intense. We know exactly where the kitty pools are. We've done this before. They're 20% off. Deal. Am I making a scene? I'm making a scene like that. Let's not do that. Chat, this is it. We're in and out. This is it. I'm moving. Okay, can you. Do you want to just like. <laughs> okay, I'm not rolling. Anymore. Okay, thank you. I'm making a scene. I know I'm making a scene. Yeah, you're the one making a scene. It would be fine. If I'm the one making a scene. Yes. You're the one holding a giant fucking camera. Yeah, if you weren't like that, it would be so weird. If you weren't so like shady looking. You making walker noises right now. Guys, stand by. Can you show them the snacks? They want to see the snacks. <laughs> Hi. I'm good. How are you? Is this it for you today? Yes, ma'am. You have a phone number with us? Yeah, can I type it in? Sure. Oh, um, no, ma'am. No. They're return. Two dollars and fifteen cents. Alrighty. Uh, go ahead. Are you gonna? Oh, you tap it. Do you need your receipt? No, that's okay. I can. I can get you one. All right, you guys. You have a fantabulous day. Thank you so much. Can you film? I had a $10 reward and I got this pool for $2. Are you kidding me? What a freaking deal. What a great start to our day. $2. Yeah, she was so nice. All right. Okay. I gotta put this in the, in the bed of the truck. Not in the bed of the truck, in the back of the truck. Okay, 
here's the pool. And we just have to go get ice and then put the ice in here. Wait. We're not gonna need 50 bags of ice. Connor's being so dramatic. Do it again. You rolling? Exact same thing again. Okay, the pool is in here. We have to get ice. The guy that works at this said we need 50 bags of ice. That's so ridiculous. Maybe you thought this pool was bigger. We're, we need like 20 max. This is gonna be so easy. This is gonna be so easy. This is the best day of my life. Wanna be a toy a key? I am still here. The guy that works at Alveus, guys, my YouTube audience doesn't know who Connor is. Hate to break it to you. <laughs> All right. I say we, we shoot for 20. 20 bags? How do you feel about that? That's not enough. Really? We need at least 50. Are you trolling right now? No, it's definitely. We're not going to fit 50 bags in there. Oh, for sure. Are you okay? Oh, God. There's no possible way. That's tiny. Okay, guys, Flip is joking and being stupid. I will wait for you being to get your seatbelt on. Do you have to be rude like that? I'm just making a little bit of... Did you call beforehand? Nope. No! Huh? Broken? Can they see? Can they hear? Hello? It is back. It's back? Um, I want to go to the grocery store mostly because people that work at gas stations don't like me. I wouldn't like you either if I worked at a gas station. Why not? You just look like one of those types that would get the cheese everywhere when you're trying to make a hot dog. I would never put cheese on a hot dog at a gas station. Chili cheese dog? You know what I'm saying? No, I would not do that. Somebody's bougie. That's not being bougie, that's just... Call me bougie. No, that's just gross. I gotta make a left turn out of here and I'm not feeling good about it. Oh. It's not looking good, folks. It is not looking good. Um... It's not looking good to the point where I might go the other way. We're just gonna go to the other grocery store, because... This is bullshit. All right, no left turn, only right turns. I have all these stories of all these places around here, but I like don't want to say, as if like they don't know where we are right now. It's very easy to figure out. Anyway, one time I got this truck detailed. <laughs> I got this truck detailed. I think I said this on my stream. I got this truck detailed. I went to the place, I like went to sign the, the paperwork to leave my truck there to get it detailed and I walked in and he closed the door and it was just him and there were like four beer bottles on the table um, and once he closed the door I realized that he was drunk and it was like all closed off and it was after hours too, it was like 6 p.m. or something and I was like, oh, I'm dead. I was like, that's, that's it for me. Um, you know, shout out my mom. I really thought I was smarter than this. Uh, but then I just signed the paperwork and left. So, you know how it is. They're asking how the detailing looked. It was fun. I mean, it was as good as it could look for a 2006 that has been beat up his whole life. <laughs> it was fine. I actually got it detailed because that guy that I was dating was coming to visit me. He didn't appreciate that it was detailed. He thought it looked old. I was like, this old truck, huh? And I was like, actually, he looks better than he has since 2016, so I don't know why you would say that. I wonder if this was the wrong choice. That guy sounded like a keeper. He wasn't. Did you ever meet him? No. You didn't? No. Really? Are you sure? Pretty positive. Okay. Guys, Con actually, that's really funny. I've never really talked about it. Connor hated him. Really? Yes. Connor hated him. He, 
I don't even know. He he came to Alveus once. He came to he came to a campfire. So we were like chilling at the campfire. A sick invite, dude. Yeah, that's probably before. I really appreciate we're that. We're friends. Um, and Connor the next day was like, you know, he. I don't remember what the phrase was, but it was some phrase. And Connor was like, you know, he said this 32 times last night, and I was like, hold on. <laughs> Number one, you do not count how many times someone says something unless you fucking hate them, unless you're like so annoyed by them already. Like he made a point to count how many times he'd said it because he had said it so many times. And I was like, no, I didn't notice. Um, and then Connor essentially said, it's going nowhere. And I was like, thank you. <laughs> okay, <laughs> appreciate the honesty. Was it just like a catchphrase or something? Like was it like, a, um, believe it? No, it was, <laughs> yeah, he kept saying believe it. He kept saying no cap. It was so annoying. He said it 32 times. He kept saying off this wave. 32 times. It was so crazy. I don't even know how he fit it, fit it in everywhere. I don't remember what it was. It was something stupid. Wait. Do you know where we are? Yeah. Am I going the right way? I'm going to the grocery store. Uh. I mean, there's one down here. Yeah, the big one. Yeah. Okay. Down here, down here. I figure the big one will have lots of ice. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, or they, or they I don't. I and got, it, like, they're so far out that they're only... Everybody took all their ice. So you just hit every gas station on the way back. Okay. Ah, this is hard. <laughs> um... Oh, it's so embarrassing, dude. This is so embarrassing. We're gonna go in there with a shopping cart and put as many bags of ice in the shopping cart and on the bottom as possible. It's so embarrassing. And be like, what's with all the ice? Oh, I'm giving my foxes a snow day. Sick. If you could fill a shopping cart, you could fill the... The pool. pool. For sure. Well, I think we'll be able to fill the shopping cart. I'm not really worried about that. Also, at Alveus, we have an ice maker. It makes about two cups at a time. So for short, we have that. And be fine. Are they still here? No, they are. What? No, I'm just kidding. Oh. Oh. Check this out. It's pretty sweet. I found it. I spray painted it. No. Oh, pink. Spray painted it. I spray painted it pink. This is a great song. How do you like this one? And everybody in chat that has a visceral hatred for country music so bad. maybe Incredible. maybe you need to look inward a little bit and see if it truly is a visceral hatred for country music or if it's a burning desire to bandwagon and fit in mm -hmm. look inward all right think about which one it is while you listen to this song If only I had an Altoid okay. tin right now. No, actually, if it does that, sometimes you have to unplug that. I mean, theoretically, you can use just about any type of metal that would extend the frequency. Or a rock. Or a uh, rock. As long as it's shown guy. Guys, we're almost here. Saying this music is depressing. Chat. Licking inward is also depressing. So
Um, I don't know, they're saying harvest. What? I don't know. What is that? <laughs> I, don't <know. laughs> I don't know what that is. Is it with two T's? Is it? I don't know how to spell. Does harvest usually have two T's? No, if it has two T's though, it's probably cute. It's not. Damn it. It's not. No, no two T's. Oh, I thought I could park there. Please, I just want to park the car. They're saying that it's elf, but with eight arms. Uh-oh. Do you know what that means? They're dead. Let me see. What? They're here. Oh. Wait, you guys are here? I mean, they're back, yes. Hey, did... We were dead, now we're back. Did you guys play the game? Did you hear about the game? <laughs> no? Good. Okay. What game? Don't want to know. Don't worry about it. Okay. We are okay. rolling. All right. Wait. What? What happened? Why are we back at 1080? I didn't change it. You made us lose the game, not that game. Okay, back on 4K30. One second. And we're rolling. And we're, all right, we're at the grocery store. We're going to go uh, buy out their entire inventory of ice and hope that it's enough to fill up this kiddie pool. And if it's not, we're going to have to hit a gas station too. Like that. In we go. Did you guys think that was a good impression of Otis? No. You underestimate how much ice that store sells? Good. That's good news for us. Hey, buddy. Excuse us. You can point that up. Okay, now I can point it up all the time. Why couldn't you point it up before? We're so far from the store. You just yell all the time. I well, when we're right in front of the like store I'm and there's employees that are. Oh, oh, oh my yeah, God. How long have we been married? Shut the <laughs> fuck up. This has been an ongoing problem. All right, guys, here we are. Wait, let's look at all the plants. So fun. Also, beep beep, there's a train. Check it out. Choo choo, where's Hank? Excuse me, I would like to cross the street. Thank you. Thank you. Look at all these plants. Should we get some for Ella? No, she hates plants from the grocery store. She's like, apparently they all have like diseases or something. Parasites. I don't know. They all look pretty good to me. But I don't know anything about plants. Figs, look how cute. You used to sell flowers? I do not take you to be a flower salesman. Dude, these are huge. What the heck? Whoa. These are, these are $20? What the fuck? What is it? Majesty Palm. Wait, why is this $20? Should I get like seven? What do I do with it? They're huge. I would like one. Do you want one? How are you gonna get it home? <laughs> My truck? <laughs> All right, we're getting a cart. This is a big cart. I feel like we're good. I feel like we're gonna be good to go. We might have to make two trips. Where do they sell the ice? Usually by the exit. Okay. 
cart's bigger than heart. No, no, no. In fairness, this is like a big cart, right? Okay, thank you. I just want them to understand that. Excuse me. I want you guys to understand that this is a really big cart. Let's go this way. That's water. Ice over there. Oh, I found it first. Yes, I did. It says ready ice, so I'm ready. Hi, please don't look at me. I'm really sorry that this is happening. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for being alive. Okay. Look, here it is. Oh, well, these bags are real small. So it begins. This looks promise. Oh yeah, we're good to go, guys. This is gonna be just fine. There's seven pound bags. One. Ugh. Two, three. Pay first? No, that doesn't make any sense. Don't stop sabotaging me. One, two, three, four. It's cold in there. <laughs> Six. Oh my god. Seven. They fall from the fucking ceiling. Do you know that? It could have. If I was on that side, they just fall like that. Wait, what is this? Nine? Eight, nine? Oh, no, I forgot. Flip! They're out of focus. Ten, eleven? Are they in focus? What? Is it focused? I don't know. I can't tell. Oh. They said it's not. Well, sorry. They're focused on the cart. Oh. Which cart? This one? I don't know. He can't see it because it's in 4K. Hello, hello. Um, how many is this, guys? Thirteen. How many should I get? Twenty. They said thirteen. I believe them. Oh my god. Okay, I don't want that bag. It's cringe. Need at least fifteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Fourteen, fifteen. Sixteen, seventeen. Mm. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. <clears throat> Do you think this is enough? You think so? Oh, yeah. But Connor said to get twice as much as I think I need. Double this. Should I just get 30? I'm gonna keep going. You How much are these? 20. 21. Oh my god, what the fuck I'm gonna fucking sue? I'm gonna sue. You Did you see that? 22.
<laughs> Flip said we're good. Chat, you think this is enough? Connor. They're saying no, but I don't know if they're just saying that to be funny. It's enough. You see how small the kitty bowl is? Is this enough? Just get two more just in case. What, 25? So 27 bags? I'm so scared. I'm so scared. I'm getting the fuck out of here. I don't like getting in there. Okay. Yeah, it was just gonna fall on me again. It didn't. Okay, this is 27. We're good. Oh my god. Can what? Can you even push that? Yeah, man. That was the most unamused man I've ever seen in my life. He is not with the vibes. Oh my god. I'm really embarrassed right now, I'm gonna be honest. I can't go in the express lane 15 items or less. I have 27 items. I just put like all my weight in this to turn it. Holy shit. This is why you pay first? I don't like the honor system like that. Really? You think so? I don't know. I think it depends on the person. I wouldn't trust you. Why? I have counted it. We're effed. You look like a thief. Where are we effed right now? Are we effed? No, they said it's back. You have 27 of the same item? You can go to the express lane? I don't know about that. Connor said you need one more cart at least. I feel like Connor's on no crack. No way. <laughs> He's being so serious. He was like, just tell them you want 50 more and go back after. He's being 100% serious. This isn't a stompy size pool. Just go to the express. Wait, should I? Is that fucked up? Hello. Hi. I'm oh, just kidding. <laughs> You know, all of our uh, sour candies is mm -hmm. this week from HEB deal. We have, uh, you get two for five. We have pink lemonade, cool. my favorite, <laughs> rainbow, kids' favorite. We have blue raspberry, strawberry, and lemon raspberry, which is lemon raspberry has less calorie than the rest of it. All right, thank you. Sure. Thank you. Yeah. You too. I was so ready to get kicked out, man. I was like, we're done. That was a crazy ad. Very rude of you. I've never had anyone do that at a grocery store. Well, I don't, was that, oh, it was like a Girl Scout thing? I was supposed to be like, I'll take two. Yeah. I don't want them. She's a good salesman, though. That was so rude of, of me? Yep. You For what reason? You at her like she's crazy. I did not. You gave her the wildest look. I was very confused. She's a very nice lady. You guys are being silly. Can you buy me that magazine? I no, really need it. No, you don't. Are you sure? Yep. You can get all that information on the internet. Chat, you don't need magazines it's not anymore. The same. It is the same. It's about the ultimate guide to Spider Man. I need that one. Seven bags of ice. <laughs> there were too many possibilities of what was going on.
is pretty ridiculous. It's ridiculous. <laughs> it's the day for it. Yeah, it's fine. So the shot looks kind of good. I'm sweating. I didn't know this. Yeah, it was gross. Oh my god. Don't tell me that. <laughs> Stop it. You didn't pay for that yet. It's not yours. <laughs> Why is your forehead so huge? Because I'm fucking intelligent. I thought they just messed up on the sliders when they were making your character. <laughs> that's so that's so fucked up. <laughs> that's crazy. It's almost if people pay for ice before getting it. Can you guys like leave me alone? You're fucking control freaks. You should get that checked out. Well, we'll go again in the part that you missed, guys. Chat. Especially now that we're in public, it's time to play the shut the fuck up game, okay? You guys, go first. They want candy. We're not giving them candy. What the hell? She's so close to me. Can I get a chocolate? No. Hi. This is 27 bags. Thank you. Okay. Holy shit. Oh my god. Okay. This is pretty easy. I feel pretty good about this. Connors doesn't think it's enough. I don't know, you guys. I'm kind of nervous. What if it's not enough? Okay. Um, I got 27 bags of ice. It was really easy. Um, and I thought, geez. And I feel really good about it. Sorry, the door didn't open fast enough. It's a really heavy cart. Um, people don't think it's enough. I'm worried it's not enough. But also, like, realistically, I don't want to process more than 27 seven pound bags of ice. You know, that's kind of ridiculous. So this might just have to be it, you know? This might just have to be it. Also, bad news. I think we're, I think we should go through here. Cause I think we're in that, right? Oh my God, this thing's so heavy. <laughs> Oh wait, I'm looking for Binky Wonky, but I should be looking for Otis. Please, please, please. I got it. I got it. Nobody panic. Oh, 
Guys, you're not supposed to. You're not supposed to do this. But I say to the man. Oh my God, we die. We die. We die. Sorry, they're pulling out. Oh my God, we die. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Okay. Okay. Mm. Um, I'm doing the rolling. Okay. All right. Actually, I'm gonna roll this. You like putting it in? Well, you think it's funny? Yeah. Okay. Thanks. It's good. He can speed it up. All right. Count them with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. <laughs> Eleven, twelve. Guys, that's 27 times 20. Or 27 times 7. I'm not, we couldn't do 50 more bags. It's ridiculous. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. The pool. Oh no. Oh no. What do I do? Saved. Up these two guys. Get in the truck. Holy shit. Thing. It's okay though. <sighs> Saved. All right, back we go, folks. Don't mind this. Don't mind this uh, sound for a minute. This car is uh, it's a little unreasonably hot right now. Excuse me, beep beep, coming through. 200 pounds of ice coming through. Here you go. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. That was not that bad. Guys, it could have been way harder to do that whole thing, and I feel like it could have been much more anxiety inducing. She just believed me when I said 27. I should have said 20. She'd have been like, okay, smile. I told you I don't trust you. <laughs> They're $2 each. Specifically because of this. We bought $60 worth of ice, guys. Not so bad. $60 plus $2 for a kiddie pool? Snow day.
for two foxes worth. It's cheaper than taking your kids to the water park. Um, maybe it's not. I don't know how much that costs. All right, back we go. Let's see what's on the radio. Guys, what do you do when the videographer that you pay starts stifling your creativity? As the creator! Okay. Your turn. Um, my first impression of you was that you're fake and that <laughs> you're ultra leech. <laughs> yeah, I do leech off of Connor. Oh my god, a little Red Bull talk. Chat, my first impression of you was that. Um, you're a bunch of big babies. <laughs> bunch of babies. What if, okay, a couple things. I don't know how the snow cone thing works. I don't know how the maker works. I don't know how the snow cone maker works. We're on our way back now, and we're gonna try to process this ice into shaved ice because then it's like snow. But what if it's really, what if it doesn't work, number one? Number two, what if it's really loud? Number three, what if it takes for freaking ever and then we're sat there for like two hours and by the time that we're done processing 27 bags of ice, all the ice that we process is melted? What if that happens? And then we ruin the snow day and all this was for nothing. Or, or, what if it's really easy, it's freaking, Easy breezy, it fills up the whole pool. We bring it up to the foxes and they immediately nosedive and they love it. Sometimes you have to take risks to make life worth living. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Stop rolling, it's so stupid. Oh my god. They said put it in a blender. No! I got a peach. In the sun, baby, she gives me lunch. She's went in the Tennessee. Oh, there's no way that we're not gonna F right here. I'm certain. I'm very 9, confident. No, just wait. Just wait, everybody. Just wait, you'll see. Flip, I'm gonna guess the color of your socks. If I get it right, you owe me $50. Black. It doesn't count. It's <laughs> not fair. I'm gonna go the color of your hearts, okay? Okay, go ahead. Black. Wrong. Wrong, there is none. Nothing there. Oh my god. The heart's very important for breathing and living. I'm about the way she kissed me. You owe me 50 bucks. even for today. Let's all flip it. <laughs> That's what his daily rate. Fifty dollars. Do you know what that purple flower is called? It's the no. It's called purple horse mint. Or lemon bee balm.
stars are kissing. What are they doing? Why are they like that? There's like two cars on the side of the road, just like bumper to bumper facing each other. Battery died and he was jumping. Oh, duh. Wow, that's like crazy stupid that I didn't think about that. <laughs> Holy shit. I thought he was gonna try to like tow him. I was like, why is he trying to tow him backwards? Guys, I'm the kind of girl that strips screws. <laughs> what are you saying? <laughs> I'm an atheist. I like that, that was nice. This is good. We don't have, I have something to tell you guys about that I haven't told you about yet. Um, I have a Conservation Uncharted episode planned. Flip is not coming this time. Um, I didn't want to come anyways. Yeah, you do, because it's... Sucks. You don't even know what I'm talking about. So. It's at the Wolf Conservation Center in New York. Um, they recently got a new ambassador wolf puppy named Silas, and we're going to go meet him July 1st is the next Conservation Uncharted episode. Um, so I'm going to New York again at the end of this month. Yeah, you're gone anyway. Um, going to New York at the end of the month and then we're meeting a wolf puppy ambassador and we're gonna learn, talk about wolf conservation, learn about wolf conservation. It'll be very good, I'm very excited, I'm very excited. It's funny, I've done what is this, my fifth Conservation and Chartered episode, and two of them have been with Whale and Dolphin Conservation, and two of them with Wolf Conservation Center. But hey, it's been a while. Last time I went to, to WCC was in the fall, right, of last year, so it's been almost a year. Or it's been over, it'll be over, no, no, I'm stupid, I don't know, whatever. Um, it'll be a good time. And he's very cute. If you wanna look at their Instagram, they've posted pictures of him on their Instagram and on their Twitter. I'll tweet pictures of him soon because they just sent me some that I can post. He's so cute. Um, they also talked about giving him a snow pit while I'm there as like an enrichment thing. Should I start pointing down? Yeah. Uh, have fun, chat. Good luck down there. Good luck down there. Are they excited? Yay! Do you think this ice is gonna irreversibly damage my seats? They said, why do you have me chained up? Oh, he tried to get away once. You gotta do what you gotta do. Jeff ass shoes, what? <laughs> Young Jeff texted me this morning, I'm so hungover with a skull face, a skull emoji, as if I freaking care. <laughs> Nobody asked, Jeff. Are you just rubbing it in that you couldn't go to... To karaoke? I don't go to karaoke because I meet up every day. What's your favorite song? Wait, let me guess. You're gonna go far, kid. <laughs> what? What's wrong with you? <laughs> and then, like, we're dancing. I can see head banging to that. <laughs> what is it? What's your favorite song? Um, 
What duck song? Fall out, boy. Slipknot. How do you know these bands? You don't even know, you're just... Like, yeah, of course there is. Why do you say it like that? Because the band is terrible. Flip! Um, you're gonna go far, kid. By... Bowling for Soup. Bowling for Soup? No. Fuck. Give me the first letter. Between the eyes. <laughs> yeah, I do. That's surprising. What's that? You know what Limp biscuit. <laughs> no, come on, stop. <laughs> Nobody likes Fred Durst, okay? Uh, who is that? Is that oh is that a Limp Biscuit guy? Fred Durst, yeah. What's the what's the song that oh, what's get got? Who's that? Get 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 got 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 got. Huh? Get 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 got 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 blood rush and what is that? That's not a song. Yes it is. Yes it is. They're saying death grips. Oh! Death Grips. A close cousin to Death Cab for Judy. <laughs> uh, you don't know that song? I feel like you would like it. Mm, no. Okay, well, um, I feel like you would like it because I dated a guy in college that dressed like you and he liked it. Okay, well, I don't like shitty power metal bands. Okay, Garbage. well, he was cool, so he take it back. Cool. Probably listened to Disturbed. I'm offended on his behalf. Lame. He played electric guitar and it was cool. And he listened to Disturbed and Avenged Sevenfold. Gross. He was also 6'7. Can you believe that? Jeez. Yeah, I dated a guy that was 6'7. It was terrifying, I'm gonna be honest. Are we F now? Are we F yet? No, not that. Wow. Dude, I have the worst news for you. Mm. We should have done this. No, it's fine. Should we have to go we have to go back out for the YouTube video. We have to do the exact same thing basically. Why? Wait. For the YouTube video that we record after this. For a second video? Yeah. Cause you're gonna be gone. Okay. So this is a video and then we're recording another one after this. Okay. So we do the same shit. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Well, we're stopping to get food today. Yeah. Because I'm gonna die. You need food right now? I never eat breakfast before I come here. That's why you're always eating a Pop Tart. Oh, oh no! That's why I'm always eating a Pop Tart, correct. A Pop Tart and a sugar free Red Bull is my breakfast. What does that mean?
can't see my necklace. Get away from me. To make sure the gate closes so the goats don't escape. The ice has made it. I really have to peege. You're gonna go far, kid. Do, 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 do. With a thousand lies and a thousand lies that I'm right between the lies. When you walk away, nothing more to say. A thousand lies. Why are you listening to Osprey Glade? I am not. This is gonna be a, a journey. Are you filming? Do you wanna film right now? And roll away. Fuck, how does that keep happening? Flip! We keep ending up in 1080. I'm not changing any settings. No. Okay. Hey guys. And rolling. Um, all right, we're back. It's time to process all this ice into shaved ice, into snow, if you will. I'm excited. That's it. Chad, did we F the whole time? How you doing? Okay. In and out. Pretty much. Most of the time. Pretty much the whole field trip. I'm so sorry. It does better with the phone, huh? They miss medieval times. Did you guys, what was Flip's favorite song? Uh, you're gonna go far, kid. I have to pee, so you can take them. Um, I'll mic up, what, you wanna film Georgie or something? You wanna go get a pop chart? <laughs> Yeah, you said you needed food. Connor, here you go. I'm gonna pee. Oh, okay. Chat. It was not enough. 20, 27 bags? Are you crazy? So much. No, I, I dude. Think you, you didn't see how big it was. No, I, 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 I know. I measured it. So when you shave that ice down, it's just gonna lose like all that air that's in there. The ice cubes have so much, like it has a huge dimple in them. It's going to fill the, the tub up 25%, and the first 10 bags are just going to melt because it is 95 degrees out. It's going to be like 103 in two hours. Everything is going to melt. Okay. But so. You went and got ice while we started shaving it. I actually thought about doing that, and then I'm like, eh, I got too much work to do. So. Um, you look very busy over here. I'm very busy. I have to actually close out of all the sensitive information that you're trying to zoom in on. Um, no, it's, it, it's um, we'll see. Now, actually, if you guys do it on the inside with the AC, that'll help because it's 75 in there. But the thing is, the foxes aren't going to want to come in there. So you'd have to, like, put it in there and then take it out and then try to get the foxes to come in. But they're also going to be freaking out, so you have to do it outside so they get used to it. So... I'm going to cover that up. Mick, Jesus. Mick trying to get me banned. Anyway. Um, I did the math. I'm the operations manager. Chat. <clears throat> anyway. Uh, yeah, I, I think that's crazy. But also, Maya didn't test the ice shaving machine. Don't let her lose her fingers. Okay. I might actually be out there. Great clip. That'd be amazing. <sighs> and then we have to tourniquet her and take her to urgent care. So we'll see. We'll see. Okay. Well, I'll have the tourniquet on standby. Go from there. The foxes, I hope, will like it. Um, I don't know. I don't. Uh, you're going to grab a Pop Tart? Uh, here. Shoot back. 
<laughs> Never mind. I lied. I need help. Not doing that. Here, I can grab you a pop tart. Nope. Too late. Too late. I'm going. Oh my. What? What are you doing in here? It's cold in here. You think I should be outside? You're gonna bring me Are you here. Are you taking the pool all the way to the foxes? Yeah. I'm not doing it by the foxes. Sounds gonna freak them out. It's way too much action. How are you gonna get inside? Huh? Like the pool. It's not that big. It's gonna fit through the door. Yeah, man. So I can fit through the door when it's full of ice. You're not getting back out. Are you sure? I feel like it will. You're not getting that back out. We just like tilt it a little bit and push it through the door. Dude, it's it's got to be like four feet max across. Nah. Yeah, that's bigger than the door. Yeah, you tilt. They'll fall out of it, guaranteed. Oh my god, I'm sick of everybody. It's not I'm so sick of everybody. Chat. This shit is gonna melt. That's why we're doing it in the studio. What do you want? What what is it that you want, you guys? What how do you want me to do this? I told you, chat, walking on eggshells. Will you? <laughs> oh. Hey folks. Connor? Don't film space. Where is he? Connor, do you think there's a better idea here? You're gonna have to do it back there. The pool's already collapsed and we're trying to pull the ice out with it. Is, do I have to plug in the thing? Probably. Did you test it first? No. Oh. Um, do it inside the, the room. Back there's 75 in there. So condense the sound. Unless you do it in buckets here and then move the buckets back there and then the ice is going to be all I can wash the buckets out real quick so it's not so dirty this sucks where's the thing what are we looking for? it's right here I do have to plug it in I'm doing it in the studio. Connor. It's good. That's going to be so loud and I don't want it in the fox enclosure. It's going to scare them. It's going to stress. I think we got to do it in the studio. I'm scared it's going to be loud. That's fine. As long as you put it in the bucket. Yeah. And then walk that in and drop buckets in there. It's all right. Okay. Heavy. It's not that heavy. Guys, are you filming? Do you want to film? Film? We're filming. This is it. This is the ice snowmaker. It's happening. Thank you. buckets. I'm going to plug this in and then we're just going to, we're just going to put ice in it and go into this bowl. Simple as that, you know, that's it. It'd be easy peasy. See, yeah, hell no, that's not going in the fox enclosure. This is going to suck ass, dude. It's going to be so loud and annoying. It's gonna take forever. Guys, we're gonna be here a while. <clears throat> maybe it'll like, maybe it'll process it really fast. This is gonna suck so bad. This already sucks so bad. Chat, I 
would like to formally apologize for the next hour of this stream. I, we might have to do this a different way. I don't know. I was just testing it. That's a lot, actually. Yeah, that's Wait. Pretty good. Don't stick your fingers in there, it says. This is actually a lot. This is like a fourth of a bag. Holy shit, we have way too much ice. Oh god. Should I put it in the pool? Like I if I put it all in the pool, we can we can tilt it and carry it out the door, right? He said yeah. I'll just keep Chat, I don't think we're gonna have to do twenty-seven bags of ice. It's gonna be heavy. Let's find out. Oh yeah, it's great. Hey Connor. I feel like we can put some in the pool and then bring the pool out. I don't think we're gonna need 27 bags of ice. I think Connor was wrong. not gonna guys I can't put the pool in the in here. Idiots. Idiots! You know what? You know what my mom always said? She said, don't let people backseat you shaving ice unless they're professional fucking snow cone men. Alright, that's what she used to tell me. So I'm not listening to any of you and your suggestions on what you think I should do. Put the whole thing in the pool perhaps? But then it's just gonna like get stuck in there and then like, I don't know. Thanks, Connor. Here we go. <laughs> this thing works great. Pretty cool. Yeah. Cold as shit, though. I'm not a fan. Thank you. Bowl upside down and then put it in the machine. Should I do that? That's a good idea. You're gonna have to bend this to get. No, it's gonna it's gonna stack up in here. It's gonna jam it. I mean, if you just set it in there. It might be easier. Let me just move it over. No, so it's just going to stuck. Water Alright. Feed it continuously. Will you guys shut the. Shut up! Oh my god! I realize you have nothing else to talk about right now, but like talk amongst yourselves or something. Holy shit! Oh, Bag 
of ice, you fucker. <laughs> it's gonna melt so much. Connor, fast. it's so much ice! You're not gonna have enough, I bet. That's insane. That is insane to double down on right now. I'm gonna be honest, you guys, this would ruin the Fox's snow day. If they heard this in their enclosure, they would not yeah. want a snow day. It's so cold. Jeez, ow, don't do that. Scary. We're using it. Someone bought that from the P.O. box. Okay. What? Huh? Pretzels? Tripod. 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 in the snow pit. This is so much snow already. This is going way better than I thought. Yes, it, Connor! Yes, it is! Second bag down. help it from melting. I hate to break it to you, idiot. The ice, <laughs> it's all ice. Shut up. You leave it on. I know, it's just loud, so I'm giving oh. them a break. Because I've got a good system now. Oh. Gear up. We have a system. It's jammed. Go for it. Yeah. Shit, ow. Can you 
please tie your hair up? It's amazing what they choose to backseat, man. It really is. I hate to be that guy, but this feels unsafe. Good thing you're not doing it, all right? You have no stake in this. You would pull your hair and you would cut it. Thank you for the six months. Boss, I will, I will contend one thing. You were wrong? That I didn't know this was a, a snow cone machine. I thought it was a ice shaving machine. It's the same I, thing. <laughs> ice shavings are a bit, a bit larger. So I am, I'm starting to come to terms with that. Sounds I wrong? like a major uh, coat. <laughs> I might, I might be wrong. I'm, I'm working my way through it. Guys, this thing is sick. This works great. Could make Gatorade snow cones for goats. <sighs> well, at least you have a chest freezer now. Hooray! Save the ice. Move. 
moves into this. Does it fit through the door? We're gonna have to tilt it, but it's like, it's, you know, like packs out. So I think it'll be fine. All right. All right. Last bit. Should we just do one more bag? Sure, if you want. Because it's going to melt like back here. So it's like, get everything. If you want, we can um, start filling up buckets too. If you want to add, use more ice for around the area. Ouch, ouch, ouch. More snow, more snow. How long will it take them to pee on it? No time at all. Um, we can do more, but after stream, I don't want to sit here and like process ice. Yeah. I don't have the attention spans for it. Oh. It's okay. Yeah, low snow. says one more bag. It's just it's a little light on the sides of the machine. Chat, one more bag? What do you say? One more bag. I could have done 10 bags, guys. Next time I'll pick up a bag and we can test and then measure from there. <laughs> one more. Oh, it's not that heavy. It's going to be fine. When you move it, it's gonna be so heavy. It's not gonna fit through the door. Chat, it's time to play a game. You know what game? That's right. Shut the fuck up, game. They go first. Yeah. Yeah. All right. 
Oh, that feels really nice. That's a lot of ice. <laughs> That's a lot of snow, you guys. It's happening. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, this thing's hot. I don't like that. Okay, whatever. Put it on the towel. Are you okay? Mm. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, guys. This is it. It's time to go to the foxes. Wow. You can talk now, Johnny game's over. Johnny Boy 9 for two months. People talk, wow. Johnny Boy 9 for one, right, two um, three subs for the first time. You wanna put time. it in the back of the truck? Sure. Okay. Okay. Ready, flip. Yes. Easy. Chat, stand by. Thank you. Sorry. It's not heavy. So, like, the door. Oh, my God. You guys are so annoying and incapable of problem solving. Sorry. No, it was all in. Yeah, yeah. Wow. They're, co they're covered. Oh, are they? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Flip, can you open the bed? Open it? Yeah. It opens? Yes. What? Oh, my God, he's oh, stupid. He's stupid. Yeah, let's get in the back. Ugh. Chat, we're babysitting the ice on the way up. Are you getting in? No, it's not for me. Shit, were you recording any of that? Oh, no. You're the best. Still recording. Oh! <laughs> we did it. We're taking it up to the foxes. It's time for snow day. This is blinding me. Oh my god. What, I can't see. Or this? The, yeah. It's time! This worked better than I thought. I'm stoked. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about our foxes before we go meet them. We have two. Their names are Finn and Reed. They came from a zoo in California. Finn was a confiscation from the illegal pet trade. Reed was orphaned wildlife. And we have the foxes to teach people about the illegal pet trade and the fur trade. All of the animals that we have at the sanctuary are rescued and are used in conservation education programs online, like this. Um, so we're gonna talk a little bit about the fur trade today, weave it in maybe. Uh, the estimation's really hard to do, but they estimate between 40 and 100 million animals are killed per year for the fur industry, for the fashion industry. It's obviously way less popular now than it was before. Um, but make sure to avoid exotic furs jewelry, exotic trophies, things like that. It's really devastating for animals. Foxes are the second most common animal used uh, for fur products. All right. We effed? No way. Did we? We were going kind of fast. Who's the first? Minx. Uh, M-I-N-K-S. Sorry, it's the plan. Backwards. Stand by. You're not gonna fit. This is Finn. He's a European red fox, but he doesn't look red. 
um, because he was bred in captivity for the pet trade. <laughs> Is he yubby? Um, and someone bought him as an illegal pet. Whoa! And that's how he got here. Have you seen snow before? What do you think? Yeah. Can you go get some? Or like a mouse? It's fine for now. Do you want to move it with me over there so we can stay further away? Further away from what? Like so we can stand over here and they can oh, play with I it see. over there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Chat, we're going to move it. Excuse me, bud. Okay. Here you go, Reed. It's okay. We can just put it here. Okay. Is that okay? Filming? All right, we're gonna leave it. Finn will come up and play with it if I'm that close, but Reed will not. Let's see what they think about that. Hi guys. Move it so the live cam can see, oh my God. He likes it. <laughs> yeah. He didn't pee. Okay, everyone's upset because it's in a blind spot for the live cam. Connor, I'm really sorry. Can you help me move this again? It's okay, bud. Um, we're gonna move it and then... Oh, uh, do you want some treats? Uh, I, don't, I think it's fine. This is fine. I'm gonna sit way over here. You just like, try not to move. Connor's gonna leave. Reed's a little anxious, a lot going on. Also? Sure. Oh, so I can do this. Well, why don't you just do it from the outside? Because you're locked in. Yeah, but I'm not. I'm leaving, leaving. That's fine. Um, Reed is afraid of Connor. Uh, because Connor had to catch him up for the last, they get uh, annual vet physicals and Connor is the one that um, catches them for it because the rest of us work with them pretty much daily. Oh my gosh. I think it's fine, they'd be complaining, oh my gosh. They'd be complaining if it wasn't. Oh, he loves it. Do you like it? Oh my gosh. Keep up, wow. Let's see some. Thank you for the sub. How many bags do we end up using? Like six or something? Oh, it was like ten. He pees. He peed in the snow. Seven bags. That's great, Finn. That's great. Reed's checking it out. <laughs>
He likes the snow. I'm having fun. This is an excellent outcome so far. Much better than the pads, yeah. <laughs> you might be able to go close to Finn while he's in there, just for like the shots. Because Reed's not coming down right now anyway. He probably will. Hi, bud. You go in the pool? There, I'll go up there. Finn, come here, bud. Come here. You're okay, Reed. Don't go anywhere. Here he comes. Come on. Come here. Reed did get shaved. Come here. There he is. Wow. We also need a thumbnail. Kind of has to be in it for that. He did pee in there. I, s I can see the pee, guys. I'm not grabbing it, but thank you. It's a big pool. Ice. Snow. Is it yummy? <laughs> A snack. <laughs> All right, I'm going. I'm not helping. You can stay back. Hoping you can get a thumbnail out of this, Danny. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of handy that Reed likes Flip. Oh, a snack. more snacks.
Reed looks thinner than Finn. Well, he is a little bit lighter than Finn, um, but he was shaved recently um, to help his coat grow back because he's had skin and coat problems for a really long time. Um, and so we had to brush out, not shaved, sorry, we had to brush out his undercoat and so it's growing back. So he looks real thin, um, but he's, he's a healthy weight at the moment. He just looks kind of crazy. Flip, can you point it down when they're there just for the thumbnail? Like when they're at the pool so you can see the snow. Yeah, I guess. They're tired. How hot is it today? Over a hundred. A hundred and three. Yeah, I think we should try that space. We're gonna throw the live cam feed up on here and Flip and I are gonna leave and see if they play with it. Is there a way I can keep talking over the live cam feed? Oh shit, yeah, let me do an outro really quick before you do that. Ready? Action. All right, Finn really liked it. Reed kind of liked it. Um, we're about to leave and watch the live cams to see if they are more into it if we're not here. But I had fun. Um, this was really great. I wanted to do, I think I should do my education stuff right now. I didn't want to kill the vibe when they were like playing in the snow, but I do want to throw more of that in there, so maybe I'll talk about that right now. Um, hold on, guys. Let me pull it up. I took a bunch of notes. Stand by. Bear with me. Sorry. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Um, maybe you do it over the live cam. Why? She's going to look worse. Because it will, like gives them gives the audience something to watch while it's happening that way it's not just like you standing in front of them oh so it's, you know what i mean it keeps retention like a voiceover yeah so like do it over the live cam of them playing in it doesn't that kill the vibe you don't you want to make like a happy it's montage kill the vibe no matter what <laughs> <laughs> you're, you could be a downer just even talking about it like, um yeah. okay we can do that We'll do both. I'll tell them right now, so I do it on stream, and I'll do a voiceover for YouTube. Ugh. Okay, well, let me reframe this. For, and can we like actually do that outro? Because you like stopped halfway through, and then said. Yeah. Well, let me do the education, then I'll do the outro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, so we have the two foxes here. 
um, to so that I can teach people about the fur trade and the pet trade. Finn was a confiscation from the illegal pet trade in California. They bred him in captivity. Someone thought they wanted a fox as a pet. You don't. Um, they mark everything. They don't do well inside. They're not meant to be pets. They're wild animals. Um, and then Reed was orphaned in the wild um, and was raised by people, and that's why he's in captivity. Both of them are non-releasable, but we get to use them both for education at Alveus. One of the big educational things that we uh, do with the foxes and the chinchillas that we have rescued here is talk about the fur trade. Um, they estimate between 40 and 100 million animals are killed, raised and killed yearly for the fur trade. Um, I know that's like a crazy number, but the reality is it's just not a well-regulated industry. There are no federal regulations on the fur trade. California is the only state in the nation that has banned the sale of furs, um, but it's shockingly easy to sell fur and to raise animals for fur. Connor and I looked it up for fun yesterday, for fun. Connor and I looked it up yesterday to see how easy it would be. And it's a one page application and a $95 application fee to get a fur propagation permit in Texas. And the cage size for foxes for fur propagation, the minimum standards are 20 inches high, four feet long and two feet wide. And I'm about five feet tall, um, so extremely small cage space. That's a minimum space required. You can also hunt, hunt foxes during the hunting season and sell them for fur, um, which is really awful. Worse than that, potentially worse than that, is fur farms, which is the most common way that, that people acquire furs for fashion and stuff like that. There's mink fur farms, there's fox fur farms. And for animals like foxes, because they sell whole pelts, I also looked up the other day, you can buy a whole fox pelt for like less than $300. You can order them online and have them shipped to you. And it's the full pelt, so like the head and the arms or the legs and the tail. Um, and to preserve the pelt, one of the common slaughter methods for foxes is electrocution. And they put a rod in the fox's mouth and in the anus, and it sends electricity through their whole body. And the reason that they do it that way is because it preserves the pelt, right? You, you don't damage the pelt at all because that's what you're trying to sell. Um, but they say that it's humane somehow because they say that it kills them immediately, but it doesn't always. Um, there's quite a bit of really disturbing video footage that I would not recommend um, of them being electrocuted and not dying immediately. So it has to be done multiple times. It's really, really awful. Um, so yeah, and it takes at least 120 chinchillas to make a fur coat. It takes 15 to 40 foxes to make a fur coat, depending on the length and the size of it. So not that fur is nearly as popular now as it was before, but really recommend you guys avoid buying fur, avoid buying fur lined jackets too. People don't think about that all the time is the lining on a hood, you know, or on the, the inside of your jacket can be fur. So you need to watch out for that. Ex avoid exotic trophies, you know, the, the feet, the tails, fox tails, stuff like that, the hats things like that, um, because it really is an industry that just, it has to go. You know, normally I'm, I'm more of like a, I try to, to bring both sides together and be a little centrist, but the, the fur industry and fur farming is just really awful. I went down quite a rabbit hole yesterday and it's really not okay. So don't buy any furs. Don't support that industry. It's really gnarly. Um, yeah, you know, that could work as a voiceover probably. I didn't really think about that. I thought about doing them separately. Um, okay, well, there's a little bit so you guys know about that. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. I appreciate it. We'll do more of these with the animals that we have at the sanctuary probably. Let me know in the comments what you want to see. And like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye. All right, let's switch it to the live cam and see if the foxes play without us. Did you guys know about that electrocution thing? Isn't that fucked up? Isn't that crazy? Mm -hmm. They'll literally like hang them from hooks, like suspend them while they're alive and do it. It's wild.
All right. I don't know if you guys are going to be able to hear me in a second. I don't think you can. Um, so. We should be able to. Not with the live cam. We can? Yeah. Are you on the live cam right now? Could Space said we will. Huh. Oh. Your cam is in the corner. We can hear you. I'm going to swap it. So they can see the foxes more than me. No one needs to see me right now. We're gonna go back to the studio where there's AC and water. It is hot out here. It is hot out here. Can you believe we have to film a whole new video after this? Sounds easy. Okay. You don't even know what the video is, but... Okay. They're all pretty easy. They are all pretty easy. Bye, foxies. Have fun with your snow day. I really hope Reed goes in there. I think he'll like it if we're not there. But if we're there, we ruin it. He hates it. Live cam is full screen, just audio. Hooray, that's perfect. Perfect, amazing, wonderful, ideal. Maya, why are you picking your nose? Gross, Oh Stop my it. god, this guy. Check that out in the YouTube video. <laughs> It'll be interesting trying to, oh my god, Reed's going over there, he's checking it out, he's in it! It's weird, huh? It stresses me out when he does that. Two feet in the snow. Reed has definitely never seen snow before. Finn and Reed have only ever, thank you for doing that, Connor. Yep. Have only ever lived in California. Um, it does not snow over there. Okay, not where they're from. They're from the central coast of California. So somewhere where it doesn't snow. Snack. They're just eating it. <laughs> Maybe they'll lounge in it. Maybe they just need some, some time to warm up, you know? I know. I trusted you. And now I have 20 plus bags of ice to deal with. <laughs> to be fair, I would have still overestimated a little bit, but not as bad. Those are seven bag or seven pound bags. I thought you were going to get five, because that's more common at the gas Oh, it wouldn't have mattered if it was five pounds or seven pounds. That is... Connor, you told me to get difference. 50 more bags than this. <laughs> and I was like, no, that's ridiculous. Imagine if I was like. Pounds, right? Difference, Is that right? Ten times. No, oh, twenty. Connor, just, no. just take the O. Take it. Ah, it's so hard. <laughs> Playing. Yeah, twenty. That's only twenty pound difference. Snow day. I think Finn likes it. I think he likes it. We're gonna have to do this every day this summer. <laughs> Flip, you in? Mm -hmm. Okay. It's a lot easier than doing the typical keeping screen. That's true. Make some, are you gonna do anything else with more shavings today? Um, I may like fill up a bucket just to give everyone like a bowl of snow okay. for fun. Because it's out and... I'll make room in it for you guys. Cool. Uh, and then you can do this whenever you want. Okay. That's what I told you what to happen. Yeah, Roll thank you. Roll. Right, 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 right. Roll. 
Oh, I guess me and Flip have to film this video and then I'll do that. Chat, that snow is so dirty. Now we, we shave a bunch of this, we put it in a hopper, and then we get a leaf blower and drop into a leaf blower and make it snow. That's sick. Won't they get sick from the dirt? No, they live on dirt. They're foxes. They're wild animals. They're all right. Brown fox looks a little emaciated. Is he okay? Um, Reed is a healthy weight. He looks a little whack right now because we had to shed out his undercoat. Um, it was recommended to us by our vet to help with his skin and coat problems. Uh, so he's getting salmon. They're both getting salmon oil now to help with their coats. Um, that's why he looks a little weird, but he's growing it back out. Finn is not really chunky. It's mostly fur. Why is it, what's he doing? They're all, what, three out of fives, right? 2.5 out of five body score. So like perfect. Perfect body condition. From the vet. So don't worry, chat. Um, foxes, uh, they run a little more narrow than dogs do. They're not built the same because they're not the same. Yeah, next time we can put some treats or mice in the snow. That would be fun. <laughs> so cute. They're just gonna like compress it. But if you got enough buckets of snow to fill the whole enclosure, God, you're right. We're, we're just not doing enough. We should have done that. What if we ask Texas to make it snow fully? We should have done that. Sorry. <laughs> We're in the studio. All right, guys. I'm going to rate into all this. We'll leave it on this cam, obviously, so you guys can see. Um, what they do with the snow, watch them have fun with the snow. Thank you guys for what, thank you guys for watching today. Um, fun stuff, good stuff. I think they had fun. I think the Fox are having a good time. It's some good enrichment, a lot of work. I have some more shaved ice to make. Um, and I think Connor will go live, not right now. Um, you guys can just watch the Foxes for a little bit. 
Uh, successful mission, everybody. Successful mission. I will make some more snow for everybody, but right now Flip, Flip and I have to do exactly what we just did again. He's really excited. He's, he is excited. Um, snack. So, I hope you guys had fun. Um, thank you so much for watching. I also, my sub, or my alerts were muted for like the whole stream because I kept muting them to go into the stores and then I was, and then I forgot to unmute them. So, thank you for the subs today. Um, I'm sorry I wasn't shouting them out or wasn't very good about shouting them out. Um, and same with donos. If there were donos, I know there are a couple that I didn't shout out. So, thank you so much. Um, this will be a YouTube video. Tomorrow we have um, nothing. Tomorrow's Saturday. Next week we have Zooperstars on Monday with the chickens. The chickens are our Zooperstar next week. Um, then Tuesday we have Goat Bingo. You guys remember Goat Bingo? We have a goat cam. Um, and then Thursday we have the Extra Emily collab next week. Extra Emily is coming out here for her collab. And then Friday, we have another keeping stream. So I will see you guys for that. There is a YouTube video that is coming out today. I filmed an updated day in my life now that I live in the tiny house. Um, so that video will go up today. But if you don't already follow Alvea Sanctuary, go follow it right now. Monday is Superstars, yes, sir. Go follow Alvea Sanctuary right now. So you guys can watch the fox, you can watch all the animals, you can watch the marmosets. Wait, why is... change the schedule. Is Superstar supposed to be Tuesdays? Yes. Oh, what the hell? Alright, swap... never mind, don't update the schedule. Swap Superstars and Goat Bingo. Goat Bingo's on Monday, Superstars is on Tuesday. Okay, go follow Alvarez. Thank you guys for watching. Have fun watching the foxes. I'll see you later. Goodbye. Everybody say thank you to Flip. And goodbye.